We continue to raise awareness for breast cancer this month. And did you know black women are more likely to die after a breast cancer diagnosis? Well, there is a multitude of reasons for this, but our Fox Carolina's Teresa Bowles relates to this personally, as her mother was diagnosed last year. And Teresa is live now to remind women to get their yearly health screens. And Teresa, this is such an important story here tonight. It certainly is. Breast cancer doesn't run on either side of my family, so it came as a surprise to us all. Listen, a delayed routine check is what likely saved my mom, Calvinia Bowles' life, and she has a powerful message for any other black women still putting it off. I went in for a routine mammogram, and I was behind because the pandemic hit. They found breast cancer in my right breast. It was stage three HER2 triple negative. Shortly after, my mom, Calvinia Bowles, started chemotherapy. When you get that type of diagnosis, it's kind of hard not to be a little bit fearful about what's next. Because the National Breast Cancer Foundation shows one in 32 African American women will die from this compared to their counterparts, which is one in 39. Uh, mortality risk from breast cancer sort of tracked together until about 1980. There was a fairly sharp divergence. There were two um, big advances made in breast cancer treatment. One of them was the advent of endocrine therapy. Black women seemingly have more hormone receptor negative breast cancers for which tamoxifen doesn't work. Studies show it could also be due to delayed diagnosis, mistrust of the healthcare system, healthcare access, genetic factors, or just not having the support financially and physically. We're just so busy trying to make it. Uh, a lot of times we put things off. The recommendation is yearly mammograms once you hit 40. Oncologist Stephen Dyer suggests women with a family history start earlier. About 10 years before their relative. The problem is the younger you get, the less sensitive mammograms are because breast density um, decreases with age. My mom is now sharing her story, such as after being honored during the Strength of a Woman Awards. Don't ever miss a mammogram or an opportunity to get one. I would want my daughters to know that there is hope. It's not always a death sentence. Though my mom is in remission, her battle isn't over. The cancer is aggressive. and She'll have to continue to be checked every few months for years, but she's here and she stands on her faith. So I implore not just black women, but all women to get their yearly mammograms because early detection always helps. Justin, Tori. Yeah, it certainly does, and we are so glad that she is doing well today, Teresa. Thank you for sharing that story with us. And Bonsa Corsine Francis has a mobile mammogram bus for women who can't get to the doctor. They can use this, and if you don't have insurance or money is an issue with this, make sure you reach out to the Pearly Harris Center to see about getting some help with that.